Plugin Alliance lets you place your licenses on a USB drive, in a USB flash drive. So that is exactly what we're going to do today. Now I've already purchased, I just purchased the SPL D verb, downloaded the installer, unzipped it. So the first thing to do is install your Plugin Alliance plugin. So that's what we'll do here. Let's hop through this real quick. Okay, and now we are done. Now we need to activate or authorize our plugin. And in order to do that, we need to launch a DAW. I will launch Pro Tools because that is my preferred DAW. All right, and since we're using Pro Tools, Pro Tools scans our plugins for authorizations as soon as Pro Tools is launched. So then we get this pop-up saying we need to authorize. If you're using a DAW that doesn't scan your, your plugins in this way, simply load whatever plugin you have. In our case, it would be uh, Dverb. Throw that onto a track and you will get this same pop-up. So now we can go ahead and activate this to our computer, which is very easy to just have it on your computer. Whenever I use my Surface, that is actually how I authorize these plugins. It's right to the computer, so that way I don't need a dongle. But for my main PC, just so I can move things around to a different PC or what have you, I like to put my license on a USB drive, on a flash drive, which of course is already connected to the computer and needs to be connected before you, uh, you know, start this up. All right, so all I'll have to do is simply choose this flash drive. I'll just say activate all my licenses. I can click I'm online. Now I just log in to my Plugin Alliance account and click activate. There we go. Pretty cool. So now Pro Tools will continue to come up. I want to show you something while this is happening. We'll come over here to Plugin Alliance. Now a really cool thing about Plugin Alliance is as you can see here, I have, this is something that I bought. So two devices activated, one available. That's right. They give you three licenses. Now pay no attention to this here. This is what we just activated this SPLD verb, I haven't refreshed this page yet. So as you can see, they give me three authorizations, which is great because that means I can authorize my dongle. I can authorize my, my Surface or maybe another computer, whatever I happen to have that I don't wanna to have to use a dongle on. And then I can have one backup or I can authorize another computer. It's a really great system that they have set up here. You don't need an iLock, you don't need anything special, just basically any USB flash drive. Just wanted to mention that and also wanted to mention the great authorization system that they have here at Plugin Alliance and giving us three licenses. That's great, absolutely love it. Now here we are in Pro Tools, so let's just make sure this comes up and it is authorized. Plugin Alliance, we just authorized SPL Dverb. Open it up and there it is, completely authorized and ready to go. Pretty cool and of course all my other Plugin Alliance plugins are also ready to go as they should have been already. And there we go, as you can see, authorized and ready to go. Okay, so that is how you authorize your Plugin Alliance licenses to a USB drive. And by the way, I'll just, let's just pop this open real quick. Right here on this PC, you can see my Kingston drive that I'm storing my Plugin Alliance licenses on and my Waves licenses. So you can do that as well. You don't need two different dongles for the Waves and Plugin Alliance. And that's the uh, license file right there. It's, it's encrypted, so you can't read it or anything like that. But that is how you authorize your Plugin Alliance licenses to a USB flash drive.